New at 5, Powerhouse Sky Zoom 4 over a partial collapse at the top of a 200 foot bluff in Alton. Take a look here. The soil slide took out part of a wall that's really an iconic gathering spot for its view of the Mississippi River. That bluff located on the west end of Alton above the Great River Road. Our Russell Kinsall is there live where he's been talking with the city and neighbors who live nearby. Quite a mess out there, Russell. It is quite a mess. Right now I'm standing in a backyard of a home that's on that bluff in a different location to give you an idea of where this happened. Over here behind, behind my left shoulder is the Mississippi River and over here is where that partial collapse happened. You can see a wall that gave way, soil slid down. That's at the top of a 200 foot bluff and that is a really popular location. You wouldn't believe how many people have a personal connection to that location that's at the edge of Riverview Park. I got married in the gazebo and then we took pictures all along that wall so and so many people have. I mean it's just a an important icon for the for the city and for the neighborhood. Rob Schubert and his family live nearby. He says he was shocked when he saw how much of the bluff collapsed. It happened late Sunday or early Monday, but the trouble really began last summer when some of the soil slid during the heavy rains that caused flooding in the area. We were notified in July. You know, it came to our attention so we came up and we put some uh, um, sandbags and things to deflect, deflect the water away from the wall in case it were to rain again. The city says the nearest home is not in any danger. The city of Alton had been working on a plan to stabilize the side of the bluff. I know there's a lot of people who are worried that they've been taking a little bit long to figure out which direction they wanted to go. For now, the city plans to remove the loose soil that remains on the side of the steep hill to stabilize it and prevent further unpredictable and dangerous collapsing. But any long term solution will be dangerous, specialized work and won't come cheap. There's costs ranging you know, from almost 400, 380,000 to over a million dollars. So there is a business at the bottom of that bluff, Abbott Machine Company. What's the risk of another slide making it all the way down there and putting that business and the employees inside in danger? We'll have the answer to that question coming up all new on News 4 at 6. Live at Alton, Russell Kinsall, News 4.